Hello friends and thank you for joining me for another yoga flow here in the membership. Today's sequence is one for the kiddos to move their body, to tap into their imagination, and to dive under the sea and play around a little bit. So parents, uh, of course you are more than welcome to join in. All of these poses are great for you as well to move and activate in the body. Um, and kiddos, go ahead and turn on, unlock, let out the imagination, and join me as we dive into the sea for an oceanic journey. Go ahead and find a big, wide, open space. Lay down a yoga mat if you want, a blanket, or just find a good, soft spot on the carpet to really let your imagination go wild. Grab something to drink, put on something comfortable, make your space absolutely perfect, and I will join you right back here for a super fun oceanic journey. We're gonna start seated. Crisscrossing the feet, pushing the sitting bones, the bony parts of the tail into the floor. Press the crown of the head high and close the eyes. Let's take a moment here. Start to think about all of the things you would see out in the ocean. What sorts of animals would you see? What sorts of things would you see in the sky? What other things besides animals might you see in the water? As you're sitting here with the eyes closed, start to see all those things in your mind. Do you see dolphins? Do you see whales? Do you see birds and clouds? Maybe some boats? What about a shark? Do you see a mermaid down in your ocean? Start thinking of all these things here. Even say them out loud if you'd like. Keep breathing in and out through the nose. Start letting your mind travel to the ocean. when you're ready, blink those eyes open. Okay, let's go on our adventure. We're gonna bring the knees together, put the feet on the floor. We're gonna push the booty into the floor, lift the crown of the head to the ceiling, hands come under the knees, and we lift the toes. This is our boat pose. Taking the hands out to the side, move the arms up and down like waves. We're riding our boat out on the ocean. Pull your belly button way back to your spine. Push the crown of your head up. Ride, ride, ride your waves out into the ocean. Good. From here, drop those feet. Swing the knees around or the feet around. Come on to the knees. And we're going to lean forward, put the hands on the floor, get ready to dive. Push the arms out, reach the legs back, reach the arms in front of you. We're diving off our boat from the arms in front. We're gonna lift the feet, lift those hands, and sweep those hands down. Sweep them back up, we're swimming. Push the hands down and sweep it back up. Come down back to those hands and just kick those feet anytime you need to or lift the hands and the feet and push the hands down and sweep them back up. We're swimming down, push the hands down and sweep it up. We're swimming now to the bottom of the ocean. Again, you can put the hands down and kick those feet at any time 
Just another couple strokes. Push the hands down and reach it up. Last one. Push down and reach it up. Perfect. Taking the hands down to the floor. Push those hands up. We are a swordfish. Point the nose up, up, up. As you push the floor away, this is cobra pose. But for our ocean journey, we're a swordfish. Point your pointy nose up to the sky. Push the feet into the floor. Push the hands into the floor. Good. From here, sit back. Knees come in. Hips go back to the heels. We're going to round the head down. Clasp the hands behind the back. And now we lift the palm of the hands up to the ceiling. Our back looks like a fin. We are a shark. Shimmy, 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 shimmy like a shark swimming. Feel so big. Feel so confident. Nobody's messing with you. Stick your fin up high. And shimmy, shimmy, shimmy and swim, swim, swim. Shake your shoulders. Swish that tail. Hands come up. We're a shark. One more breath here. Good. Take those hands down to the floor. Good. Let's take those knees wide. Reach those hands way out long. Touch the hands together. Our hands are our tail. Our toes touching is our nose. And we're swimming like a stingray. Have you ever seen a stingray with its wide body and its pointy tail? Touch your hands together. That's the pointy part of the tail. And your hiney and toes are the face, the knees wide as the body shake from side to side as you swim through the water. You are a stingray with a pointy tail. One more moment here in our child's pose or stingray pose. Good. Perfect job. Let's walk those hands back towards the face. Take the knees together. Untuck the toes. Push up and back. You're a whale breaching through the water. Push the booty high, high, high. Hands down. We're breaching up out of the water like a whale. Lift off those toes. Push into the floor. Reach it high. We're a whale. And walk those hands towards the feet. Good. Roll it on up. Let's be an octopus. Take the feet nice and wide. Point the toes away. Sweeping up with our tentacles. Bend the knees, sweep down. Sweep up with your tentacles and bend the knees wide, sweeping down. Sweep it up. Swimming like an octopus, even squiggle those arms out to the side as the feet and the legs go up and down. Good. Bending and straightening as you sweep it up and sweep it down. Octopus squiggling in the water. Good. And now we come up and stop. Arms reach away. Toes point away. Head up. We're a starfish. Reach your fingers away. Reach the feet into the floor. Reach the head to the ceiling. How far can you reach everything away from each other like a big, beautiful starfish? You're a star. Feel it here. You're a star. Take another breath. Feel your star. Ooh, I'm a big, beautiful starfish. Good. Take those hands down. 
Let's be squiggly like a seahorse. Have you ever seen one? Take your feet, hip width distance. Bend the knees, stick the booty back, lift the arms, chair pose. We're squiggly like a seahorse. And jump, and jump. This is how it looks like seahorses swim. Sit the hips back and jump. We're a sea fan, seahorse. Good. One more time. Jump it up and sit it down. Take it to the floor. Touch the feet together. Taking the hands under the legs. Round, round, round that back. This is our turtle pose. We are rounding like a turtle. Our back looks like a turtle shell. We're pulling in to ourselves. Thinking, reflecting, taking our time to breathe here. Big, deep, slow breaths like a big, slow turtle. Good. And now we slowly come up. Take the feet nice and wide. Sweep up with those arms. We're a big squid and reach for the toes. Good. Sweep up with your squid tentacles and forward reaching for the toes. We are a big giant squid. Sweep up with those tentacles and fold forward. Good. Imagine how big you can be pretending to be a big giant squid full of squiddy ink. Keep sweeping up and reaching for the toes. Last one, swimming like a squid. <coughs> Excuse me. Bring it up. Let's hug the feet together bringing them in and now with our feet in and our knees wide we are coming up and we're taking our hands to our belly and closing our eyes we are a puffer fish so as you inhale push your belly out exhale pull it in like a puffer fish how big can you make your belly inhale and let it all out a few more times. Inhale big. Exhale out. Breathing through the nose. Puff or fish that belly. Inhale. Exhale. Keep going. Puffer fish breath three more times. Fill that belly. Two more times. Last one. Good. Let's climb back into our boat. Take the knees together, feet down. Hands beneath the knees, lift, lift the crown of the head, riding the waves back to shore, wiggle those arms, maybe go fast, we're hurrying back to shore, or we're taking it slowly, where is your boat at? Good, for three, two, one, put the feet on the floor. Let's put the hands behind us and push up where a crab. Push the belly up to the ceiling. Push the feet into the floor. Push the hands into the floor where a crab. Maybe even move 
from side to side like crabs walk. Lift the booty, lift the belly. You're a crab, crab, crabby crab. Don't pinch mom or dad or brother or sister or the dogs or cats. <laughs> and lower it down. Good. Let's take the hands to the knees. We're gonna roll on to the back and roll it up. We're a hermit crab rocking and rolling in our shell. Good. Keep it going. Just a few more. Be a hermit crab rocking around in your shell. Last one. And we lower down onto the back. Take those arms out wide. Feet out wide like we're a starfish laying down. Close the eyes and let's come into Shavasana and reflect on our journey. As you close the eyes, think back to the animals we got to play, pretend with. Did you like being a turtle? How did it feel doing that pufferfish breath?
shoulders. Point the toes to the floor, stretch along with the arms, then hug those knees in, give them a good squeeze as you roll onto your side and slowly press up seated. Let's close the eyes and all together, let's acknowledge our connection on this beautiful journey through life, like we just took a beautiful journey through the ocean. Sweep those arms out nice and wide. Touch the hands together, then pull those hands down to your heart and tuck your chin down. The light inside of me sees the light inside of you. And I am thankful to be on this journey with you. Namaste. Thank you, friends. I hope you had fun. Come back and do this anytime you want to stretch your imagination, move your body, and just get out of the house and explore the ocean, even if you are like me, right in the middle of the panhandle of Texas. No water to be found. We can still swim in the ocean with our imagination. Thank you.